More local coverage now. What is old is set to be new again. Today, work is going to start on the new East Providence High School after voters approved millions to fix Rhode Island schools. And as you can see in this video, the current building is so badly in need of repairs, parts of it had to be closed off to students. Eyewitness News reporter Brandon Truitt joins us live in East Providence looking ahead for us. Patrick and Danielle, this has been years in the making. In November, voters overwhelmingly approved a bond. That includes this $190 million project. And today, state and local leaders are expected to break ground on the project. When you look at the pictures, you can see what it should look like when it's all said and done. The more than 300,000 square foot building will be considered state of the art, featuring 45 classrooms, 10 science labs, and two greenhouses. It will also uh, feature career and technical courses offering graphic design, culinary, broadcast, and construction classes. School leaders say that these changes are long overdue. This is going to give them the 21st century high school, and I'm just thrilled for them. And we hope to bring more students back into East Providence as well with this new high school. Nearly three-fourths of the total costs are set to be reimbursed by the state's Board of Education. The project is set to be complete in 2021. Live in East Providence, Brandon Truitt, Eyewitness News.